entertainment capital of the world from behind the doors of these famous studios come the motion pictures that entertain thrill and educate countless millions but there's more to hollywood than just movies and if you're a camera addict the possibility Here's a subject that seems to have possibilities, and how. Add this, plus your camera, and the world-famous jungle compound where animals are raised and trained for the movies, and you're all set for some very unusual pictures. Lady, that's a lion licking your hand. What's the matter, fella? You jealous? Wayne Morris seems to enjoy the show. Now it's time for refreshment. Yes, he's cute and cuddlesome now, but it won't be many months before he'll use that fierce determination to give some trainer a bad time in the big cage. Buddy Rogers also takes in the sights. Professional jealousy is even prevalent among animal actors. So, Mary the Elephant, like any other actress, is not to be outdone. Boy, there's a lot of real Academy Award material there. Adele Jurgens is simply fascinating, as Jackie, the famous movie lion actor, struts his stuff. No group of stars would be complete without beautiful Marguerite Chapman. And Raja, the tiger, literally gets rolled. In the famous names department goes the name of Blackout's Camel. He was born backstage while his mother was co-starring in Ken Murray's Blackouts. And Morris seems to have found other attractions rather than animals. Lady, there are lots of ways to get a fur coat without trying to put the poor leopard under your spell. And who'd blame Jack Carson for staring? Now this is literally a case of spots before the eyes, and poor Cheetah is really in a spot now. This guy Morris really gets around. Now here's what happens when two female actresses get together. Now, which one should be cast opposite Clark Gable? If you're a divot digger, you and your camera will have a great time following Jimmy Dunn, Johnny Weissmuller, and Gilbert Rowland. They're all avid golfers and darn good picture material. Nice drive, Don Amici, but why take it so seriously? Tarzan prefers swinging clubs to swinging from trees. And John Carroll needs plenty of elbow room. Bill Lundigan, Myrna Dell, and Broad Crawford put on a little horseplay before teeing off. And of course, where there's golf, there's hope. Perhaps your camera and you crave action. Well, Hollywood annually puts on some of the fastest, wildest rodeo seen today. Here are the nation's best riders and cowhands pit their brains and skills against some of the toughest critters from the Western Plains. This fugitive from a milk bottle makes a roller coaster seem like a kitty car. And over the waves might just as well be this Bronco Buster's national anthem. Whether your steed has four legs or two wheels, they're just as furious. Of course, the object is to stay in the saddle, climb the hill, and hit the finish line in the shortest possible time.
The annual Hearst International Regatta at Long Beach Marine Stadium attracts the best outboard drivers from all over the world. Brother, when these boys are spilled, they're literally all washed up. After all that excitement, perhaps a little rest is in order. The photo fair can furnish that in the form of gorgeous models like modern Diana, the Queen of Sheba, Lily Marlene, latest in beach attire, barefoot boy, Famous cover girl, on the right that is. Or even famous movie starlets like Mona Freeman or Noel Neal. Chester has probably had more custard pies thrown in that face than anyone else in show business. Gags like this were always sure of a laugh in the good old days. Enter the villain. Pie throwing was your specialty, Chester. Let's see how it was done. Get ready. Ooh, too much follow through there, fella. Come on, Chester, you show him. That's, that's it, thank you. Get ready for the pitch. There's the wind up. And it's a hit with all faces loaded. Oh, well, folks, there are other ways of making a living. No trip to Hollywood is complete without a gala evening at some of its famous night spots with entertainment in the continental manner from the most colorful talent in show business. about as far as we can go in this film, folks, so goodbye from Hollywood.